Hey y'all, it's Taryn. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to Taryn with no makeup. If you watch the vlogs, this is typically how I look, but when I film a like regular channel video, I try to get a little bit ready. However, today it is storming outside in this very moment. It's not, ironically, um, but it's also hot. So it's 82 degrees today. So it's muggy. It's raining. I just couldn't, I didn't want to put makeup on and try to fix my hair because the minute I stepped out, I would sweat it off. All right. I'm sitting outside of a Burke's outlet. So I've done this like bargain shopping series, I guess we can call it. So we did Marshalls, TJ Maxx, Ross. And in those videos, so many people recommended Burke's Outlet and Burlington. So I've done a Burlington haul here on my channel. Granted, it's been years ago, but I haven't been inside of a Burke's probably since high school, middle school. I can recall coming in here because in Alabama, no matter where you go to school, you wear school uniforms. So not just private school, public school wears uniforms as well. And I remember coming in here looking for khaki pants and I think that's the last time that I've been in. So I did do my research. I looked online. They do carry plus size in store. Their fitting rooms are open. The things I found range from like tops for 10 or 12 bucks, shorts, $7.99, $9.99. So I'm hoping we have some good luck. I'm on the hunt specifically for black heels, like open-toed summery heels. I wore the only pair I owned last night and discovered as I was wearing them that Cash chewed on the toe. Um, so I need to get me another pair. Also, speaking of last night, I realized that I don't have a ton of going out clothes. Like I have a ton of graphic tees, bike shorts, denim shorts, um, like cuter t-shirtish tops, but I don't have a ton of things if I were going out like date night type looks. I know that's hard to believe, but it's true. So that's what I'm looking for today. We'll do shoes, all the other things. Um, and then if you guys still want to see Burlington, we'll do it. But for now, let's go in while we have a lull from the rain. Also, I'm pretty sure I'm the only person here with the exception of maybe this car. And then these are probably the people that work here. Um, there's like no one in this parking lot, which is good because it's Saturday. And y'all know I talk to myself in videos. I got caught in my Walmart video. Someone heard me in the fitting room when they were like, you wouldn't happen to be at Walmart right now. And I was like, yeah, that's me. You caught me. Let's do Juniors Plus first. And then I see like women's right there and maybe some dresses. Okay, how cute would this be for Nashville? Boots and bling. It's a cowgirl thing. How much is it? Let's see if they have, that's a 1X, 1X, 3X. Okay, I like this. Didn't I just say I didn't need more graphic tees? That's cute. Even knotted up with some jeans. I like these bike shorts. A two pack for $10.99. Ooh, they're soft. We may just grab these. Black and sunflower. Like we probably don't need to try those on, but we'll take them. I don't see a ton of other, ooh, I like those. What size are they? They look a little bit small. 2x $6.99 hmm they're not very soft and I just feel it looks like the elastic band is this but it's only right here you see so we're gonna pass all right yeah not a ton of bottoms they do have jeans let's see if they have any brands Lee petite it's not me skinny we don't want blue do y'all know this brand hmm. oh they have a bunch of that brand so for reference capri in this brand 15.99 not a bad price but most of them are like those capri or skinny or jegging it's not really what i'm looking for these nickelodeon crops are cute so now we're in the tops, if I didn't say that already. I can tell pretty quick if I'm gonna like something or not. We don't need graphic tees. Why do I get sucked in so easy? I think I'm gonna grab this for my sister. It's like embroidered flowers on the ears. It's a little bit big for her, but she could knot it up or wear it like along with bike shorts. Okay, maybe not. Does that matter? Yeah, okay, Never mind. Found another one. 
we'll inspect it, but it looks better. Okay, we're gonna grab it for her. I think she would love that. All right, I see more plus size already here than anywhere else. So see, all this rack is 1X, all these. They start 2X and then all of that's 3X. So yeah, we, we're bound to find something, right? So let's start with these dresses first. They may not work, but <laughs> we know that's how that works at places like this. All right, so this is a blue. I love the ruffle at the bottom. It is lined. It's got the smocking at the neck, so I guess if you wanted to do it off the shoulder, you could. This is in a size extra large. I think it could be cuter, maybe belted with some white sneakers. What do we think? I like the length. I love the color and the pattern. What do we think? Could be cute again, belted, but just like this, not my favorite. Next one we have is this. I pulled it because it's that brand Knox Rose, which is sold at Target. So I thought maybe it could be a steel. It's $12.99 in a size extra large. I like the little drawstring cinch here. The buttons, I love the colors and the print. I think it's a little bit snug, but maybe if it were an extra, extra large, it would work better. But could be cute, you know, sandals, sneakers, you know the drill. So, not bad, not bad. Okay, and then we have this one, also in a size extra large. Lined, it's the same brand as this blue one right here. Just a little bit ill-fitting. Like these straps are super long and you can't adjust them. And it's a little bit, the lines aren't straight. <laughs> I like the tear at the bottom. I like this little hem here at the waist. I like the colors. It's just okay. I don't know if it's meant to be like that or if it's supposed to be straight. I think it's supposed to be straight. See, it kind of lines up, but it really did have potential. It has pockets. I pulled a ton, not a ton, but I pulled quite a few tops. Um, so let's do this one first. I love the pattern. I love the style of it. I think I need one size larger. It's just a little bit snug right there. I like the ruffle at the bottom, the length of it. Okay, shorts button up all the way in the front. Ton, ton of stretch in them. They're like a raw hem at the bottom there. These are in a size 20 W. They actually fit really well. It's that same blue brand of the jeans that I showed earlier. I don't need shorts. I really pulled them for the fact I just needed something to show all these tops with. So top, they actually did have quite a few out there. So they may have this one in one size up, but it's a cute springy summer top. My cowgirl top, the first one that I pulled, I really don't love it as much on. It's a thicker material. It's a nice shirt. I like the print. Um, I wish it were a little bit longer so I could knot it or front tuck it or something. So it's probably a no-go. Really, I thought this would be the one thing that I would buy from this haul. Um, it's okay. Again, not my favorite, so I probably won't grab this. All right, last top with these shorts. I just pulled one side of my bra down so you didn't see it. You can see what it really looks like here. I thought this could be cute with some jeans to go out. I like the print. I like the skinny strap, the cold shoulder. It's a little bit flowy. Again, I'd probably just wear like a bandeau or strapless with it. I didn't do a very good job of hiding it <laughs> on this side there, but I really like this one. It fits nice, it feels nice. So I think that we'll probably end up grabbing this one. We have these really cute tropical pants. I know so many of y'all are going to love them. They have a cute little drawstring tie at the bottom. They button and zip. The pattern is so fun. I wish they were full length, like joggers or like wide leg pants. And I think that I would just like them more, but the print is really cute. So I pulled this hot pink tank, front tucked it, cute. Here's what it looks like untucked so the tank is sort of a high low or well, quite a bit you can see shorter in the front longer in the back has a little bit of lace detail a little detail on the neck yeah if these were jogger pants i would buy them for sure but this length is just not my favorite i don't think okay so last thing we have definitely doesn't go together but these pants this is how i wish these pants were I love the length of them, perfect length. They've got a smocked waistband. 
They fit so nice. How much are they? $12.99. Love the pants with a white top and some sandals. Yeah, these fit so nice. Okay, so I'm grabbing these top. Apparently I'm into tropical today. It's okay. It's very thin, which is nice because it's a little bit warm outside. But I don't know, what do we think about the top? Okay, welcome back to my car. I did make a purchase, we're not surprised. I bought the pants, the last pair. Uh-oh, my AC's kicking. Of like flowy pants that I tried on. I bought the cold shoulder top. I'm trying to find my receipt. Um, and then I got my sister that Mickey top. It was like 30 something dollars for all three. You saw them. Um, so I'm very happy. Okay, listen, Burke's Outlet has the best of all three combined with a plus size. Every single section in that store, with the exception of Juniors, now not Juniors Plus, but Juniors, every single section had plus size activewear, sleepwear, swimsuits, uh, dresses, bottoms, tops. Every section had plus size and a lot of it too. So shout out to y'all because I would have never thought to go in because again, I haven't been in in years and years, but they had such good stuff. Now granted, most things weren't really my style, but I feel like so many things I knew my mom would love, like I got my sister that top. So I need to tell them that we're sleeping on Burke's Outlet because so much stuff in there. Um, fun fact, it's sunny outside now. So I could in fact just waited two hours <laughs> and then put makeup on my face and fix my hair. But here we are. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. I wanna go to Burlington next because again, so many of y'all recommended it and um, had such good luck. Oh my gosh, I'm just so shocked with the amount of plus size, I guess, because so many stores that you go in now these days, it's limited and you have to get the rest online. So to see so many is just really, really nice. Now, they do have a website, I'll link it down below, um, but they didn't have a ton online. From what I remember, and I may be wrong, but I'll link the website down below. I did look at shoes, by the way. A bunch of people had come in within like five minutes of me walking in the store. So I didn't film anything in shoes. I didn't try any of them on. They didn't really have any that fit what I was looking for. They did have some cute sandals, um, but nothing really that I felt like I needed. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, thumbs up, subscribe. Thank you all so much for telling me about Burke's Outlet. I'll be back. This store, the one where I am in Mobile on Schillinger Road, if you live here, um, is very clean. They had a ton of outdoor stuff that I looked at too you know, maybe for under the pergola, but didn't end up grabbing anything or else I would have shown you. So thanks for watching. Um, and now I'm going to continue on with my journey of finding some going out outfits. So if you like this video, did I say already thumbs up, subscribe. It's still hot outside. It's just sunny and hot now. So, okay. I'll see y'all in my next one. Bye.